Hi, welcome to BTH channel. Assuming you frequently work back and forth between your desktop and laptop. And you want to sync your data between those two computers. In this video I will show you how to sync data between those two computers. Here I use SyncThing, it is a real-time data synchronization program. Your data will be synced directly between two computers and not stored elsewhere like cloud services. So your data will be more secure. In this example I install SyncThing on the desktop first then install SyncThing on the laptop later. After installing SyncThing you need to set up a username and password when you want to access it through the web interface. SyncThing will create a folder for you that you can share data with other computers. If you want, you can create different folders for different sharing needs. I will use the default folder to sync data in this video. Let's create one more text file to try to see if it appears on another computer after syncing. The laptop that wants to connect to this desktop needs an identifier. And this is this desktop identifier, if you use a smartphone you can connect through the QR code. I sent my desktop identifier to my laptop. So that you don't wait long I have SyncThing pre-installed on my laptop. Just like the desktop, you need to allow SyncThing to go through the Windows firewall. For the safety of your data, you need to create a username and password when you want to access it via a web browser. You install SyncThing on different computers is the same. I will now connect to the desktop using the identifier obtained in the previous step. Even though you already have an identifier, you still need desktop consent. As you can see the two computers are connected to each other. On the desktop I will set up data sharing for the laptop. You can create separate folders to share with different people. On my laptop the data is already synced with my desktop. Now the two computers will synchronize real-time data with each other. In addition you can also sync data with your smartphone. Good luck! Don't forget to like share and subscribe to the channel.